In this video, we are going to list the steps involved in installing a timber frame pavilion kit from Lancaster County Backyard. The first step in constructing a timber frame pavilion is laying out the exact post locations. Take a tape measure and mark each post location using the provided measurements. Check if the layout is square by measuring the diagonal distance from corner to corner. If both diagonal measurements are equal, the layout is square. The second step is to set the post brackets and posts. Anchor each post base to the cement footers using two wedge anchors. Once this is complete, attach each post to a base with structural screws. Step three involves installing the rafter plates and supports of the pavilion. Start by connecting the braces to the posts and insert temporary rods into the pre-drilled holes. Then, set the rafter plates by aligning the posts and support braces to fit inside the mortise slots of the cross beams. After this is complete, insert the supplied oak pegs to lock the mortise and tenon joinery into a rigid singular unit. Step four is installing the roof system. To start, install the trusses or bents. Next, install the ridge beam. Finally, install the pre-cut wood rafters between the ridge beam and rafter plates. Step five involves installing the roof planks. Begin by fitting the roof planks together with the tongue and groove joints. When they are properly placed, nail them to the wood members underneath. The sixth step is installing the roofing paper and drip edge. Make sure the roof is smooth and free of any dirt and wood chips. Use a stapler or nailer to fasten the roofing paper and drip edge to the wooden roofing planks. The seventh and final step is installing the shingles or desired roof of your choice. Make sure the fasteners do not protrude through the roof decking. Now, invite some friends over and enjoy the beauty of your new gathering space. If you are interested in ordering a timber frame pavilion kit, fill out the timber frame pavilion quote request on our website. 